Good. I hope no one saw you. No, master. You go get the blood ready. As usual. Yes, master. seem to understand why the Council of Kings will treat me the way they just did. I know what they want. They want my throne. They will not get it. Not on my life. It's okay, Your Highness. Okay. Take care of what belongs to me. I know. I mean, I, I don't expect that to be coming from the Council of Chiefs themselves. Can you imagine that? I understand. It's okay, you have it. Dad? Are you okay? No. Oh. Larry? Yes, sir. How are you? I'm good. Honey, just calm down. I'll be upstairs. Oh. Mom? Yes, Dad. Did you upset Dad? I did not. Then why is he angry? <sighs> the meeting didn't go well. Oh. Sweetheart, how are you? I'm fine. You've eaten right? How are you, Larry? Please take care of him. I'm coming. Take it easy. Sure. Miss it. Okay. Oh, they'll be fine. Great Lord Zuka, what oh, oh, time for you? It is time for me to pursue my presidential ambition. <laughs> I want to be the president of this country. <laughs> you have to bring me the princess in her How do I know the princess in her menstruation? It is up to you to figure out. But you have to perform the sacrifice within 99 days. And you must be to find a day before the sacrifice. Do I have to kill a princess in her mentis and take her womb? No. You only have to lay before and leave the rest of it. Do I have to lay with a princess in her mentis? Yes. You have. Yes, 
Good day, Dad. Mm. Dad, I'm going out. I'm having a date with Larry. Mm. All right, sit. Is your relationship with Larry that serious? Yes, Dad. He's the one I love. Hmm. How far are you willing to go with him? To death do us part. To death do you part. To death do you part. You see, it takes more than love to get there. And I hope, I sincerely hope that you are not engaging in immoral acts. No, Dad. I'll see your good little girl. Mm -hmm. All right. Have fun. Thanks, Dad. Are you deaf? No, boss. I want to give you an assignment. I want you to sniff around and find out if there are princesses in this town and beyond. Okay, boss. Ah, oh, he will be my king. You ever leave? You know, <laughs> political time. Yes, uh, yes, I agree with you. Oh, my you king, sit down. Thank you very much, <laughs> my king. You ever leave? Thank you, my king. A dude does not run in the day for nothing. I said this after something. Or something is after. After the dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right, uh, uh, before you go on. What can I offer you to drink? Oh, no, 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 my king. If it were merriment, I would have answered Chief Sidetos Ifani's call. But as I speak with you now, your kingdom is divided. Those who don't want you on the throne are now eating and drinking. That bastard. So his senatorial seat is not enough. He now wants my throne. I wonder. In my investigation, my king, the fact is that he doesn't want your throne. He doesn't want my throne. Yes. Okay, so what does he want? <laughs> my king, he wants to break your throne. And he wants to be the first king of Asama Kingdom. That's exactly what he wants.
What can you do not do? He's stopping all this. Do you know what I hate? I hate people disturbing others with the sound that emanates from their love making. Who are you? And why did you buy it to my room? Your room? The room you left open to make love? Oh. Don't you know him? Is this not honorable? Honorable, so you shit on your wife with little girls like this? Is that what you do? Honorable! I go fuck you up. Ma, fuck you up! Honorable, from henceforth, you are not going to move up. If, make a video for me! Make a video! Make okay. a video! Honorable, do your hands. Please, stop, please, stop it, stop it. Stop what? Stop it. Please. Honorable, you're not allowed to allow Please, stop, please, please. Let's talk about it. Let's, let's talk it over. You're shooting on your wife with a little, okay, with a little girl. Stop it. Don't, don't do this now. Stop, stop it. Make it. Why are you doing Stop it. Honorable. Out. I know how to deal with you. What's all this? Stop. Get out. It's my turn. Just make a video. You've gotten it? Yeah. Honorable, get out. It's my Get out of there! Come in, the door is open. Why are you wasting your time with this boxing of a thing? Hope you're not planning on hurting anyone. No, baby. Boxing is just for self-defense and I think you should start practicing because you never can tell someday you might need to defend yourself. I don't think so. I don't have any enemies so I don't need it. I'll leave it for you. Well, Thank you. Come around more often. Oh, why is always my pleasure? <laughs> it would be nice to have you. Oh, hold on. Uh, sweetheart, um, okay, no problem. I have received it. All right. Thank you, darling. My daughter. My, oh, my king. I know you have a daughter, but I've not been able to see her all this while. Well, you won't see her, honorable, because she's always busy. Busier than the father. She's a big girl now. She's just 23 already. Oh, I would love to see her one of these days. On your next visit, I assure you, you will see her. All right, my king. Thank anyway, you. Anyway, thank you for coming. Thank you. It's always an honor All right. to be in your presence. We needed some money. And I want like um five million naira. I need to settle some stuff today. So 
He said that I will understand that maybe you're not in a good mood. We'll discuss it when you come inside. I think I just got a perfect plan. Registered. My favorite? Yes, sir, your favorite. Um, vegetable and white rice with fish. No. You know that is not my favorite. So now you go inside, take your bag, clean up. I am coming to you. Please, sir. Said that you get out of my presence and go do what I ask you to do. I am coming to you now. Don't waste my time. You guys go to me with you. What can I bear with you? You are proving something. You know what I hate? I hate some useless humanizers who use government money to chase after little girls. And I also know you've been stealing from the government. So I want my own share. Hmm? Honorable, do you hear me? You'll be giving me two million every month. What? Where do you expect me to find such money? I expect you to get it from the same place you have been stealing from. Yes. This is blackmail. Yes. Blackmail. Is that what it's called? Blackmail? I think I like that name. Yeah. It's blackmail. Uh, Mr. Man, I'm sorry. I will not be part of a game. Go and look, I swear. Honorable, I know you did not come to this place in your own will. 
On a good day, you will not believe me. You look around you in the middle of nowhere. Nobody can trick you. I can kill you and bury you. Nobody will know about you. I can also kill your family and bury your family. Now, Mr. Man, what do you really want? I, I begged you. I begged you several times to destroy the video and forget this whole thing. What is your interest? Why do people in government believe everything is common? That they can get whatever they want at any point in time, do whatever they want and go school. Why? Honorable, you have met your water loops. I give you one month to tell me to me. If you fail to do so, what am I borrowing to me? I know you're smart enough. You can always find your way out of here. <laughs> Chief Amadi, you know, that sounds quite funny to me, but I was actually thinking that you had aligned with Senator Ifani. So I'm surprised you're here, even. God forbid. I was just there to see for myself, to know more of his plans. Chief Obi is aware. Mm. Yes. Chief Amadi is right. Oh, yes. he's right. He's right. All right. Tell me something. What is he planning? <laughs> My king, he wants an autonomous community to make himself a king. Mm. Using his influence as a senator to make Assam a small kingdom. That is what is telling the people. On my investigation, he is fighting for more. Which is to delete a Lama oil record from the books and personalize it for himself and his partners for Bunkery. Oh. So that explains why he has been fighting me dirty. But you know what? He is not going to succeed. My king, we don't just have to fold our hands and pray it does not succeed. We just have to do something fast if we don't want him to win. My king, as we speak, there are some refinery machines in his compound. And I was told more are coming. We have to do something to stop him. So, my king, what do we do? Okay. My queen, speak. My queen, I think you should go and visit the king because he has been perambulating around the throne ever since the elders left. Perambulating? Yes, my queen. Where is Ojana? He's at the backyard, my queen. Tell him to meet me at the throne room immediately. Okay, my queen.
tell one of the maidens to get him water. Senator Ifai does not want my throne after all. So what does he want? <laughs> you won't believe that. He wants an autonomous community. What? Yes. He wants to divide my kingdom and shut us off the oil producing zone. Honey, so what are you going to do about it now? Girls, you guys are Why are you guys quiet? <laughs> uh, uh, what? Who brought you here? Uh, uh, what was Donna was telling you to fight? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not tell you. Oh, yeah, sure. Like you too like Shabi, you came here and he left. You want to gossip. That's your business. Hey, you come you and carry. Okay. Carry me now. You love gossip. Leave this person. Guess, guess, guess. There's fire on the mountain. What happened? You better start praying. The headline is that this community is going to be divided into two. Are you this is just the headline. Wait for the news at night. Oh God! What are you going to? I can't wait for it though. This community. Hey. Hey. Yeah, I don't want to hey. run. No, I don't know where to run to. I have arranged a woman for you. She is royalty. You will get married to her soon. For are you joking? I know. You're pulling my legs. And I was in some. The decisions you take in life determines what you become in the future. But she is the only child of the king. And anyone who gets married to her becomes the king. Is she pretty and sexy? Is that your preference in a woman? But I don't expect me to have a queen who's old. Have you ever seen the normal clay princess? No, really, but um, if I'm getting married to her, it should be for the truth. And that will not stop me from getting to my third. I must get to third with my mind. No sense is that. Kind of a shoulder, you know. <clears throat> I heard what you said. Consider my target. Nothing serious. I'm just um, trying to ruminate over a whole lot of stuff. Um, let me ask you, my dear. What is your view about Adora's relationship with that foreigner? Oh, I think they look cute together. Mm. And you think? It will end in marriage? I don't know. But I don't think the elders will accept a foreigner to be their next king. Exactly. And that's why I am a bit happy that Honorable is asking for Adora's hand in marriage for his son. Is that so? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a better choice. And it's to our own advantage. Oh. How do you mean it's our own advantage? Your Highness, 
the house of Cain will not dare threaten you anymore if they realize that our in-law-to-be is their future president. <laughs> well, that's a good one. It's a very good thinking, as it were. But um, I'm wondering how Adora will take it now that she's obviously in love with Larry. Well, I don't know. The odds are against him. Mm -hmm. And you think Honorable's son will be a better alternative? Honey, Honorable is a good man. True. And you know what they say. A fruit cannot fall far from his tree. Hmm. Wise saying from my dear wife. <laughs> my dear wife, you always will have a way around me. I'm glad you're happy now. Oh, God. I haven't spoken with you now. Um, let me talk to her. Okay. Oh. My daughter. <laughs> Vulnerable is asking for your hand in marriage for his son. What? I hope you told them I'm in a serious relationship. Of course, I told him that I was going to discuss with you first before reverting to him. Dad, I love Larry. I know. And I'm engaged to him. Listen to me, my dear daughter. Your privileged position as a princess does not permit you to marry just anybody. Do you at any time think that when I am gone, the kingdom would allow a foreigner to be their king? Dad, I am not willing to sacrifice my love. Oh. Then we would end up losing everything. And I am not going to have worked all these years only to end up losing all. I will not let that happen. So, Princess, how's Larry? He's fine. What's wrong? Is he okay? He so, is. So, what's the matter with you? My parents want me to marry someone else. What? I don't believe it. They want me to marry the son of a minister. I'm, I'm surprised. I thought your father is well traveled. By the way, why is he against Larry? Well, they said um, they can't allow a foreigner to be the next king. <sighs> Princess, I think your parents are right. Yes, we can't allow a foreigner to rule over us. So you support them? I thought you were my friend. We are still your friends. And that's why we have to tell you the truth. Hmm. How can I break up with Larry? Besides, I don't even know the guy they want me to get married to. Princess, you just have to break up with Larry. And give the guy a chance. No.
and that could lead to him losing his throne. You know, it's not possible. Yeah, he said something like that. But don't forget that he is the king. And he can manipulate anything in his favor. Please tell me that. He is the king. Do you think it's as easy as you think? I'm going to don't lie. Don't tell anyone I said this. Please. Mm. Oh. Yeah, man, no, You pass that. All I ask for is a good reason. My love of over seven years have to be on the line just so that the kingdom would be saved. My dear daughter, it's not what you think. It's not what you think. <laughs> How do you want me to see it? When you trade your only daughter and child's happiness to a man you barely even know just to get back up, father. Adora! Don't say a word, mother! Because as a woman, you should know better not to trade your first love for anything. I'm disappointed in both of you. Ada, Ada. You know, when a child doesn't know the look of medicine, she calls it leaves. <laughs> Adora. You don't have to take it the way you're seeing it. I want to be left alone, mother. Ada. I need my privacy. I know how difficult it is to let go of someone you love for this land. But to be honest with you, this kingdom is worth sacrificing anything for. But I for one will not sacrifice a single penny, not even a cobble, for that idiot, that bastard Ibuka. Do you know him? He's a beast. I know him too well. He is no different to his father who is nothing but a pretender who tries to buy everybody's love just to rule this country. So dear, this bad. And my parents want to force me to them. Someone I don't even know how he looks like just so that he'll hold on to his kingdom. No, my princess, no. Your parents are ignorant of the kind of people they are. And that is what you need to enlighten them for. My father will not believe anything you just said. He will do anything just to keep his kingdom. You said you've not met Ebuka before. Yes, even his parents. And on social media? Not at all. Okay, um, now look at what we're going to do. Eh? You are going to change your name on social media so that they will not know how you look like. Yes. Why? <laughs> Come on, princess. Trust me, I have a plan.
She's planning to dump you. <laughs> oh, Sandy, when did you become a comedian? Are you for real? She's dumping you for your rich guy. <laughs> Listen, I told you I was in a hurry. And as you can see, I don't have time for gossip. Please excuse me. Why did you pull over? There's something I need to tell you. I, um... I'll be staying away from you for a while. What? Why? It's complicated. But... I need to be away from town for like three months. Three months? Wait, 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 wait. Are you breaking up with me? No. No, no, no. I'm not breaking up with you. But... Then why do you want to stay away for three months? I can't tell you the reason now. But I'm definitely not breaking up with you. Don't take me for a fool. I know you want to end this relationship because your parents do not approve of us. Well, I hope he makes you happy. Sorry, like... sorry now. We just want to know if it's true that the place has broken up with me the line. That's all. I know you your ears are wide open to hear what I will say. You, this is your favorite bit of one jeep. See Idiot. I know you girls are lovers of gossip. You know, gossip. As this is your hair, we of one jeep. I need you like gossip. Cho 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 cho. You'll be seeing everything in this palace. Aww. That's more what's happening. Just, just, I'll just keep for her. That's all. There's a way this You're gonna have feelings. Look, you see you. You're having feelings. You just want to go and sleep with that. You think I don't know. Is that not what you want? That's not true now. Ah. That's not true. Oh. The top thing that I want to your clean your slippers. These slippers or whatever it is. Mm -hmm. It's not what it is, then what is it? It's really What is it now? Oh, you want to go and collect his number? I can give you the number now. No, you know what you're thinking. Just ask the question. Think ask me about my dear. What's Larry saying? Eh, eh. What's Larry saying? Is Larry, Larry? Mother love Larry. Ah. 
what you should do. If you come here the next time because of this nonsense, eh? Now me, I'll take you. Give me the reason of to sacrifice. Ah! You! Shut up! Go, 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 go! Ah! Go! Go! You will be like. No, you will be like. Coca Cola, listen. Go! What are you doing? Go! Dad. Mom, I'll be traveling to Enugu tomorrow for a short course. Well, that's quite sudden. Why didn't you tell us about it earlier? Because it's impromptu and I just had to call him. Why do I have this feeling that you just want to run away? Adora. Ne. Are you leaving because we said you cannot get married to Larry? No, Mom. I just want to upgrade myself. Really? Tell me, are you going with Larry? No. As a matter of fact, I broke up with him yesterday. Oh, oh beautiful. I mean, the gods are answering our prayers. That's wonderful. If you broke up with Larry just yesterday, then it's expedient that you stay back and prepare to marry Ebuka. Mm -hmm. If you want me to marry Ebuka, then I must go for this trip. What are you implying? The only way I'll marry Ebuka is when you, mom, and dad allow me to go for this trip. Please trust me. I know what I'm doing. You sent for me, my coin. Uzoma, what was the thing you told my daughter that made her drop her fighting blow and choose to leave for me? My queen, please. Allow her to embark on this journey. She needs some time to be alone. She needs to be alone so that she can forget about Larry. My queen, she just lost a relationship of seven years. Seven good years. My queen, she's thinking of starting up a new life. She's Thinking of starting up a new life with the Honorable Son, which she barely know. It's all right. Maybe. Thank you, Highness. Where is my daughter? My sweet angel, you know we love you so much. You are the only thing we have on earth. See, we can never do anything you. Not possible. I will speak to your daddy concerning your trip to Inugu. Alright? 
Whichever way, ma'am, I'll still go on the trip. And I don't want you people to look for me or come after me. Adam, I've heard you. But I'm going to give you a rosary that will protect you from all evil that may come your way. It's blessed. And I don't want you to take it lightly. <laughs> Sweetheart, excuse us. Let me talk to your daddy. All right? Uh, I guess most of you have marketed me, yeah? <laughs> Your Highness. Mm -hmm. Once your face is like this, I know you want something. Your Highness. Oh. I think you should allow her go on this trip. No. Our brother thinks she would not come back if I do allow her to go on the trip. Honey, trust me, she will. She will come back. Oh. Let me ask you. Why is this trip so important to her? Honey, you know she just went through a heartbreak and she needs time to heal. Oh. In that case, then she can as well heal here. We have a beautiful place. Oh no, please. Let her go. Please. My dear wife, you know I would not force your hand out do anything to make you happy. It's okay. She may go, but she will have to go with a maid. Baby, let her go alone. She needs this time. Please. Hey, fresh gist is about to land.
No. <laughs> No, that's not what happened actually. I see him. Yes. Um, let me call you back. I can't believe you really want to do this. Aren't you the one who brought up the idea? I didn't know you would take it serious. Well, my mind is already made up. So how are you going to do about the disguise? I don't know. I'll just disguise myself as some other person. If possible, work for them. You? Work? I might be a princess, but I do work. So how long do you plan staying here? I don't know. As long as I'm able to get through to them. Please. I don't want my parents to know that I'm here. I already told them I was traveling to Enugu. So what if they go looking for you at Enugu? That would be their problem. Young lady, are you okay? Yes sir, I'll be fine. What is the problem? So I lost my job. Is that why you want to kill yourself? Okay, go ahead and kill yourself. Let's get out of here. Don't you think you need a different approach? Because clearly the man has no interest in you. So what should I do? Mm, I have a solution. Try seduction. Seduce him. I know you can do that. No, I disagree. Why don't you deal with the son personally? But I don't even know his son. Do you know the how? Yeah, I think I have the address. So we start from there. You still need to be seductive. Why do you like and always think about sex? Oh, please. I wasn't talking to you. I was just advising her. And that's the kind of advice you give her. Here. Did I not tell you to give this to Mrs. James? I'm, I'm sorry, madam. I, I forgot. What did you just say? I forgot, ma. You forgot? Yes. Can you remember now? Yes, madam. 
Um, now get out. Get out of here! You dumb fool. Your produce is ready. Mm -hmm. oh. You see, I don't need the fruit juice. Okay. I want to make sure I'm welcome. Mm -hmm. Don't you ever try that rubbish again. What? You just... Yes. Just Did you just hit me? Did you just hit me? Don't you ever try that rubbish again. Are you stupid? Whoops. Ah. Hey, keep that. Who did you do that to? You dare insult my son? Are you on the same level? You low life brat. You know what? Go in there, you pack your things, and leave. The girl you met at Honorable Thompson Street. I'm fine, I know. I just got fired. Is that job still available for me? Wow, thank you so much. Thank you hundred times. You don't know what you've done for me. Thank you. Oh, where's Chica? Honey, I fired her this morning. Why? You fired her? Why? She was misbehaving and she started growing wings. And you didn't see it wise to tell me when I came home? I'm sorry, honey. I forgot. In that case, you better go in to the kitchen and prepare something for me. I'm starving. Okay. You have to make sure you get another house help soon is important i certainly will <laughs> I don't want any of you to go against my rules and regulations in this palace. 
Are you listening to me? Yes, ma'am. Having said that, meet Chica, our new worker. Please, I would like you all in this palace to extend the love and care I've shown to you all to her so she can also feel at home. Chica, mm -hmm. you're welcome. Thank you, my queen. Oluchi, yes, I would like you to teach her all that she needs to know in this palace. Oh, you're welcome once again. Thank you, my queen. Have you worked as a housemaid before? Yes, ma. I worked for a year. Why did you quit? I didn't quit, ma. The family traveled abroad. I hope you do not have any criminal record. No. What? A pretty girl like this can help criminal record. Oh, will you shut up? She hasn't gotten the job yet. Um, you look familiar. Have we met before? Um, I don't think so, sir. Give her the job. I'm not done with her. No, what else do you want? Huh? She's good looking, she's strong. Give her the job. Okay, you get the job. You can start tomorrow. Thank you very much, ma. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Yeah, what's the name of it? Adora, sir. Thank you. You're cool. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Yeah, she's cool. <laughs> yes, she's cool. <laughs> it's good. <laughs> Who's the mom? <laughs> Hello? Which money again? Oga. Okay. Hey, Oga, okay, listen to me. I've already paid you for this money. Oga, okay, I need money. I need money. I cannot wait. I cannot wait. What are you talking about? I don't feel what's in this month. Oga, okay, I don't feel what's in this month. I don't feel it. Yes, I don't feel is it because I debate with you? I suppose don't add, I suppose don't even run enter you. I just they think I'm likely with you because because I bless I like you small. Oh God, arrange the money. I cannot wait till next month. Arrange the money at the come collector. Not this thing, oh God. No, they do that rubbish. Arrange the money at the come collector. Nonsense. Hello, hello. Damn. Not again! What have I gotten myself into? I need to do something about this. Before this man runs me dry. You know you're pretty. Thank you, sir. You know I actually allowed my mom to employ you because of your beauty. I hope you know. Thank you very much for What is all this thank you, thank you, thank you? Auntie, do something better than thank you. What is thank you? How do you mean, sir? What I mean is this. I want me and you the wrong show. Can you feel me? Or maybe my girl. Huh? And that way you're gonna be free in this house. Everything is gonna be at your back and call. Maybe you don't understand. Maybe you run me. Maybe you take care of me normally. Aren't you supposed to be engaged to the princess of Eloama Kingdom? 
Say, Auntie, I see you love speaking English. You speak English a lot. Aren't you the one who's supposed to get married to? What the fuck are you talking about? See, I am not getting married to that girl. Because, you know why? She's not even as pretty as you. Yeah, she's not. I am getting married to that girl simply because I want to help my father's uh, political ambition. Not because of anything. Not because of love. Do you even know the princess? I don't need to know her. But I know she's not as pretty as you. You understand that? Yeah, um, maybe somehow she's lucky to be a princess. That's why they accord her that name and respect. But I know she's not as pretty as you. I'm very sorry, sir. I can't be your girlfriend. Ah, sir. Ah, sir. You can't do that. Please excuse me, I'm busy. Hey, excuse me. Nobody walks out of me. And you can't say no to my request. Listen to me. I get whatever it is I want. Don't make me change my mind. Don't make me hate you. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? Little predator. Oh, Larry. What a surprise. What can I do for you? I, I have been trying to reach Princess, but her numbers are off. So, can you help me get her new number? I'm sorry, I don't have her new contact. Did she change her number because of me? No! Like, she's currently doing some assignments and she needs full concentration. That's why her phone has been off. Then, why didn't she tell me about this assignment? She did, but you thought she was breaking up with you, so you weren't paying attention. Mm. Okay, what is this assignment? I can't tell you, but whatever she's doing, she's doing it for you. Okay? For me? How? Just trust her. Okay, where at least can I find her? Don't go looking for her. Why? She needs full concentration. Don't worry, I'll tell her about your visit when she contacts me. Okay, thank you very much. Yeah. Bye. I'll bye. tell her. Okay? Bye bye. But it's time you move on. I'm here to help you out.
girl. Just come down. I said, get out. Get out! Honorable, where is my money? Um, I went to the bank now to withdraw the money as we have agreed. But unfortunately, if I get to the bank, they have finished. This is past. Which bank is that? I don't know what happened. I was told that they are having some logistic problem. I couldn't make it. Forever, you're joking with me. You think I'm playing with you? Um, uh, Mr. Man. I think it's high time you call up this team. Yes. I have paid you two million naira on three different occasions. Yet, you keep disturbing me. I don't think I can continue with this team. Please, let's cut off this team. Because if, if you don't forget about this deal, I am going to involve the police. I will report it to the police. Uh, yes. And trust me, I will do it. I am not joking. Enough is enough. Do you value money more than your life? Politicians. Okay, but we both. I'm broken. Politicians, you steal from the government, yet you don't want to give me. Sorry, boss. I think we should keep this one to hold and then walk on the princess of Inwama. Get me all you can on her. Alright? Yes, boss. Thank you. I'll take my leave now. But Dad, what is it? You're oppressing me in this house. I don't like it. Then I'll watch yourself. Watch yourself too. Okay, um, like I said, Princess Adora is my very good friend. And I can link you up with her father. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So all you have to do is to prepare a good proposal. Yeah, that's all. Oh, okay. Alright, I'll talk to you later. Alright, okay. Bye.
Hello. It's me, Ali. Can I join you? Suit yourself. Thank you. Look, <sighs> I've heard you talking about Princess Anna. Do you know her? Why did you ask? Well, I'm just a big fan of the way I was okay. Are you sure? Yeah. Alright, I'm a best friend. Wow, well, that's good. Well, uh, I'd like to meet her some days. No problem. Right now. So you just have to talk to me about it, then I'll make you No problem, no problem. That's good. Uh, uh, so, uh, are you true? I hear, um, how much? Maybe we can go somewhere or Come in, come in. Come in. Good morning, sir. Good morning. You asked to see me? Oh, yes, I did. <laughs> come sit by me. I want to tell you something. I'd rather stand, sir. Come on, I don't bite. Come sit by me. <laughs> sit down, I will not harm you. Come on. You see, I can change your life. I can make you wealthy. If only you will agree to be my little princess, mistress. Well, you have a wife, sir. Deliver you from 
spiritual manipulation in the name of Jesus Christ. You will be saved from the hands of the devil. What's going on here? Well, can't you see I am praying for her? Praying for the housemaid in our matrimonial bedroom? Can't you pity a little girl that has spiritual problems? How dare you bring her into our bedroom? How dare you? Sorry for what happened the other day. I um I I so sorry. Hello? It's the wrong number. I, I even thought it was Aga calling me. Hmm. So this idiot still loves Adora. This is very humiliating. Hmm. Now, oh, wow. I have to get rid of Adora once and for all. Oh my god. You're welcome, Your Highness. Adora! Adora! Wow! The same name with my daughter, Princess. <laughs> That's the name of our housemaid. Where could she be? Excuse me, I'll be right back. And don't forget to call Ebuka.
Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, how you doing? Yes. Your highness, my son, the Buka. The Buka, you are in laws. You're welcome, please. Honorable. Yes. You know, I'm looking at your son and I'm seeing a good looking and very strong man. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. And I was so happy. Thank you. Thank you. Definitely. <laughs> exactly <laughs> what you mean. That's what it is. Where is her daughter now? Honey, there's no sign of her. I think she's gone to help Lily with her wedding preparations. Dinner is ready. Let's move to the dining. We'll talk more after that. I went out, ma. You went out? While you knew we were expecting important
You know what I hate? I hate to see lunatics, low lies, compete with me in when it comes to rest of a woman. Can you imagine? A woman I want to love is loving a low life. I shall deal with him good next time. I want you to go pick him up. Drop him as you want. Salasa for the bosses, sir. I shall decide his friends. Calling me. Yeah. I'm here now. So, what's the information? Like I said, I'm um, Sally, a friend to Princess. You know, one thing I don't like about human beings they beat around the bush a lot. Can you go straight to the point? Just calm down. Princess Adora is getting married to her whole fiance. And if you don't get past, you lose her forever. Is that what you called me? Should have said this over the phone. Hold on. Isn't this word information? What's that your name again? Sally. I like you. Don't make me change my mind. Alright? I'm actually going to have a drink somewhere. I don't know if you can join me, if you don't mind. Why not? Okay. For the first time and sleep with him. Who? You're a hell, bitch. That's what you are. Um, no, I wouldn't I wouldn't say you are not sweet, you know. I enjoy everything. You you're damn sweet. Yeah, I owe you for that. So I don't know if I have much. In you. you know, um, I don't know how much I have left. I'm sure about two hundred thousand or something. Use it for your transport. Hmm? About the number I give you, don't call me. I call you when I want you. You don't call. Me. Do you understand that? So get up and go get drugs and leave this room. Thank you. She used to be with us. Are you kidding? 
Eden, no? She's one of our maidens. Do you know an evil? It's a small world, actually. It is, it is. It's good she's here. Thank you, Chief. Thank you. My honorable. Your Highness, I came to inspect some projects and I decided to drop in and say hello. As usual, my ever hardworking honorable. Thank you, my king. Thank you so much. I also want to use the opportunity to see our daughter in law, the princess. I hope. She's at home. Unfortunately, she's not at home today. She actually traveled to Enugu for an outreach, but I'm sure she'll be back soon. And I think I think uh, we should speed up the process for this marriage. I agree with you. I want us to come and do the knocking tomorrow. Oh, <laughs> tomorrow. <Yes. laughs> My honorable, always very fast. Um, but um, tomorrow, tomorrow, why don't we wait until next weekend when we would have prepared very well for you? Next weekend will be all right. Oh, the beautiful. Let's cheer. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Are you the blocker who has been clocking around my lady? Were you not told she belongs to me? Were you? Thank your stars that I'm in a good mood. If not, I will kill you. And nobody will cough. Do you understand me? I don't want you anywhere close to my woman again. Stay clear! Are you done? Excuse me, please. You know what? I want you to fish him out. I want to know who he is. Fish him out and know who he is. Do I make myself clear? It's not ready yet. It's ready, ma. Please get it for me. Okay, ma. Here you go, ma.
Prisma. What's this? Fruit juice, ma. Didn't I teach you how to prepare fruit juice for me? Don't fool. Get out of my sight. Hey, I mean you. Come here, nigga. Do you know me? Yeah, you're the minister's son. Better. Good, you know. Who's the lady with you? Who's she? My girlfriend. <laughs> Your girlfriend. You know what? I don't like retired old niggas like you hanging around pretty down south. It's not meant for you. It's for me, bro. Do you understand that? Go home and watch play for your mother. Alright? Hey. Hello? Come. Come be with me. I said come here. No. She doesn't want to show me. Okay. Okay, go. Yeah, let's bounce like bounce. Hey, bounce, bounce, bounce like bounce. Come on, nigga, bounce. I said bounce, nigga. I said come on, bounce. My chiefs, my daughter, my only child, left home in the name of healing her wounds after I dislodged her from her long-term lover, who of course is a foreigner, because I know that a foreigner cannot rule our people when I am gone. More so that Honorable has asked my daughter's hand in marriage for his son. <laughs> like that good news. <laughs> Congratulations, my king. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, my king. With the influence of a presidential candidate on your side, don't you think it's enough to fight Senator Ivine? So I thought. Yes, I actually thought so. But now I am feeling bad. I'm feeling bad because my daughter is gone because of my own quest.
to hold on to my kingdom. So I am thinking, my chiefs, is there a way we can work this so that my daughter can marry the foreigner and I will find a different way of dealing with Senator Ifai. I think that's impossible. A foreigner can't rule us. My king, I suggest, I support you go ahead and give her hand to Honorable Son, Ebuka. It's better than a foreigner. His father will be a good partner to help us save our fallen kingdom. Mm, my king, I think Chief Amadi is right. My king, forget about being a foreigner. Um, if your enemy gets to know what is in your mind, now it will not be fine for autonomous community again. But that will be an opportunity. Finding a way to detroit you. Thank you. I have heard your individual advice. But just in case we have forgotten the late King Dadao Tutu the second was a man who saved our land from the enemies decades ago. This man was a foreigner. I also remember very well that my own forefather, Giryo Tutu, gave his only daughter to this foreigner to marry. And this foreigner later became the king. I hope we remember that vividly. Don't you ever lay your hands on me again. Because if you do, I will not only break your head, but break your hand also. And don't you dare think of firing me. Because if you do, I will expose you. I know about your escapades with the gate man. So they did all that to you? I'm going to your house. If you brought this to yourself, well, thank God it's all over. You're not going back to that house again, no? Who said it's over? I'm not yet done. What? You just said living with them is like hell. 
My job in that house is not yet done. I need to get a rape attempt from him before leaving that house. Girls, I need to get back to the house before they come back from their journey. These people will kill you. Well, Larry came looking for you. He's worried. I'll see him later. Take care, girls. Take care. What? Oh, listen to me! This should be the very last time you, your father, or your mother will try harassing me again. Because if you do, I don't mind poisoning you to death! Take this message to your father. Is running out for your sacrifice. I am doing all I can, but Sweta. You have to be very careful with your maid. Are you saying I cannot have her? She is not on my radar. I cannot see her, and I do not accept people I cannot see. But don't waste your time with her. Just go look for a princess. And then I will have her for fun. You have to do whatever it feels necessary. But remember, time is running out on you. Time is running out. Your Highness, I am not happy. And my son is not happy neither. We have not set our eyes on our daughter-in-law and my son's wife-to-be. We don't even know whether she exists. Uh, not at all. Uh, but I want us to see our daughter-in-law, my son's wife to be. I want her to come and stay with us for a while so we can get to know her. No, Your Highness. We are coming to see our daughter-in-law tomorrow. So call her, tell her that we are coming tomorrow so she can come back. All right, thank you, Your Highness. Thank you.
Hello, Mom. Do you mean they've done the knocking already? Oh, yes, there. They have. But, Mom, I asked you to wait till I come back from the trip. What is left now is for them to come and do your engagement. Mom, tell Dad to delay the engagement, else I won't marry him. Adora, why are you so insistent on delaying your own engagement? Mom, just give Dad my, my message. Just give Dad my message, please. It's all right. I will let him know. Mom, I have to go. I have to go. Please. Uh, all right, then. Take care of yourself, please. I love you. What is that on your neck? Oh, it's a rosary, sir. I don't want to see you wear that anymore. Why, sir? Are you questioning me? I said, I don't want to see that on your neck. Else... I'm sorry, sir. I can't take it off. It's for protection. What? It's for my protection, sir. What protection? Protection against demonic powers and those who want to... I will you shut up? What do you know about demonic powers, you little brat? I don't want to see that on your neck anymore in my house. Now you get out of my presence. Let me see you made it in. I've not really gotten any proof yet, but from the little findings I've made, it's, it seems like they're a hypocritical character of um, being nice outside, but inside is, they, are, they are very different. They are different in entirely. You won't believe even the room I'm staying in, this their mansion, is in the boys' quarters. I don't even have access to drinking bottled water. I drink water from the tap. I'm talking about water, you're talking about drinks and juice. Let me drink water first. My feeding, I feel like a dog. And at times, they even lock me in a dog's cage. I don't believe it. Oh, I'm still here for now. I'm not giving up yet. I'm still here. Oh, don't worry about me. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Please, don't let my parents know about this. Please, I beg you. Okay? I'll call you back. Why was she not here when the Honorable's family came for the wine carry? And as it stands, I'm sure she's not going to be here for the remaining traditional rites. But to be honest, she knows she's not leaving this kingdom any good by running away. Because she knows she's a princess and whomever she gets married to becomes the next king. So why love a man who's not fit to be a king? Well, if I'm the princess, I'll go for the honor every song. He's so handsome and has class. Huh. I believe he will make a better king. I'm so glad. You're right. I know it's not going to be easy for her to forget of her life. But she needs to give the young man a chance. Believe me, he will love her better. Hmm. Honorable son is not going to love her better. From the picture I saw in Ojana's phone, that guy is a beast. He's a bastard. Akugo was the one that employed me in this palace. And the only way I can pay her back is to advise her against this bastard. You sound like you know him too well. I know him very well. I used to work in Honorable's house before I came here. Oh. You are a friend to the princess? Yes, sir. So how well do you know her? I know everything about her. Everything about her? Yes, sir. Good. Do you know that she will soon become my son's wife? Yes, sir. Good. I want you to tell me everything you know about her. 
Now, what do you want to know about her? I want to know her menstrual cycle. What? No way. Do you want to be with her? Oh, come on now. No, I want to make sure that she's fertile. I can't tell you. All right, I know what you want. Look at this. These are dollars. <laughs> Plenty of dollars. <laughs> if you will give me the information that I want, this will be yours. She's having a simple cycle. Hers lasts for six days, and I think she's um, having a flu tomorrow. Good. Thank you. You're a very lucky girl. <laughs> you will have more. Well, this is dollars. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. All right. Alpha, go get my money and make sure the girl is in his tree. Sally. Have you seen Adora this morning? I just got off from bed. Okay, remember we'll be going to see your wife today. So you go and get prepared. Good morning. Do you know where Adora has gone? Uh, no. Maybe she should be in her room. You mean you haven't seen her today? I haven't. The last time I saw her was yesterday afternoon. Are you sure? Yes, ma'am. Everything is. Adora has disappeared. Yeah. I knew it. That girl is a ghost. Oh, shut up. You're stupid. Now go back to your duty post. This 
Oh no. Baby, yeah. She has gone. Who is gone? I told her. She's no way to the house. And her things are not in her room. Are you telling me that she has run away? Yes. And no one saw her leave the house? She's nowhere to be found. Well, did you ask the security? Yes. He said he hadn't seen her either. Alright, don't worry. I'll do something about it when we return. Is your son ready now? He will soon be ready. Okay, um, let me try stuff. Quickly, quickly. Okay. Joke or what? Your Highness, is she your daughter? She is my daughter and the princess of this land. She walked with us as a maid. Yes. What? Father, I didn't go to Enugu like I told you. I went to live with Honorable and his family. Father, I needed to know the family I was going to get married into. I needed to know them better. Honorable here is a very bad man. He tried to sleep with me. And his wife, on countless occasions, beats me up. She even locked me up in a dog's cage. Talking about Eboka, the man you want me to get married to. He tried to rape me twice. He is an animal. So tell me, Father, is this the kind of man you want your only daughter to get married to? She's lying. Big liar. If you don't want to marry my son, just say it. Instead of cooking up these terrible lies against us. Adora, please tell me that this is a lie. You have to believe me, Father. I have no reason to lie against them. I wanted to get a proof, but I couldn't wait. So I had to come back to put an end to everything and let them see me. How could you cook up such a story just because you don't want to marry my son? You are such a disgrace. She's not a disgrace. But you are. I'm sorry, my queen, for lying to you when you asked me of this family. This young man here, Always rape me anytime he feels like. <clears throat> My time in Honorable's house was like living in hell. As for Honorable, he always used me as if I'm his sex slave. I couldn't leave the house because I'm an orphan. Talking about Honorable's wife, she always locked me up in a dog's cage. Sometimes she would not even give me food or water. And I have no place to work. You can help me at the moment. You can see the evidence. Now, can any of you deny what she has narrated in pain? You're the lie. It's all lies. Honorable, will you please shut up? Shut up! As a matter of fact, leave my compound this minute. Oh, my king, are you saying I should leave you? Leave my compound. These are children. It's against you. Oh, oh, shush! One more word. Now, up! Up! Out!
Honey, mm. now that Honorable is history, how do you intend fighting Senator if I? I have done my best. Having found out that there's nothing I can do to stop him, I'd rather let him have his way. Mm. And then keep up with whatever remains of my kingdom. I'll be just fine with that. That's all. Uh -huh. <laughs> my king, mm. you have won. Uh -huh. uh, one what? What have I won? <laughs> you have won, my king. <laughs> you really need to stand and dance the victory. <laughs> uh, I don't understand. What kind of victory? Chief Obi, you've started again. You have won. <laughs> my king, policemen invaded this community and arrested Senator Ifani and other chiefs. In connection with all your reserve area, they want to claim. But they want, they want to. <laughs> and we were, we're just talking about it. I'm telling you. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> Am I dreaming or what? It is not a dream, Father. No. Oh. My chief, huh? I greet you. Yeah, but princess. princess. No, no. It is true, Father. When I heard about the case, I told Larry about it. And he decided to take the case up with the help of his father, the Chief Justice Matiba, mm -hmm. and three senators in regards to the case has been arrested. Oh. Oh. Father, the so-called honorable son you wanted me to marry has also been arrested for attempted murder of Larry. Mm -hmm. My chiefs. Isn't that good news? Good news. Good news. <laughs> this cause for celebration. Yeah. Hey, you are right. <laughs> My chief, you are right. Call the maids. Let them bring drinks. Let's start from here. Yeah. Yeah. My people of Iluama, this is a great day in our land.
that we are witnessing the crowning of the crown prince, the future and hope of our land. <laughs> this is the second time a foreigner will rise to the successor to the throne in the same circumstances. Yes. <laughs> and I, Chief Obi Atulogo, I'm proud to be the one that will cry you Larry Adas to the successor of the throne of Elutut. Hi guys here. Hi Abale. Hi Abale. Friends, what do you want? No, no, no. Mm. Oh, you're in there. You're in there. People are saying, oh, my greet you. Right. Ah. People are saying, oh, my greet you. Right. 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 People are saying, oh, my greet you. Right. 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 Right.